It's May of 1983. 19-year-old rookie bull rider Lane Frost is in Del Rio to challenge Darth Vader. Okay, boys. Okay, boys. Del Rio was the richest bull riding in the world, featuring world champion bulls like Darth Vader. Bulls who teach rookies what bull riding is all about. It's May of 1986. Young Lane Frost is back in Del Rio one more time. He repeats his champion as the world's greatest bull rider. Now what do you say, Del Rio? Ooh. He was named co-champion along with his traveling partner and future three-time world champion, Tough Peterman. Congratulations, you guys. Tough. I'm really glad to see you. Thank you very much. Thank you, Stuart. Appreciate it. Thank you. With all the beating you take, with all the beating you take, ain't it about time? See, you make it look so easy. He goes out there and gets his butt kicked and picks it up. Well, it's easier for him to do. It was ten years ago that Lane Frost had one of his greatest rides. He earned a standing ovation for this spectacular ride in Cheyenne. He was on his way to earning $10,000. He was back on top of the bull riding world. What a great bull ride. Thanks, George. I tell you what, I was needing it. I knew it was my turn to buy dinner. I, I had to do something. I'm real tickled. But you just had to give the crowd a thrill with that dismount. <laughs> well, I don't always ride that good, but I can usually get off pretty exciting or do something afterwards. <laughs> that was to be Lane Frost's last interview. 1989. Cheyenne Frontier Days. Tough Hedeman's world was changed forever. His partner Lane Frost is having a spectacular ride, but he couldn't get away from the bull. He was gored by the bull's horn. Lane climbed to his feet, but before he could reach for help, he collapsed and died in the arena, just a few feet in front of Tough Hedeman. When he carried his friend to his grave, Tough Hedeman vowed that he would win the world's championship that year for his partner, for his friend. When Tough Hedeman walks into an arena, he no longer thinks of just the money, or the crowd, or the trophies. He thinks of his friend, Lane Frost, and the glory they shared together. Now he's still as fresh in my mind as if he as if it happened yesterday. I mean not I mean, it's, you know, people say that, that, that time heals everything. That will never heal in my mind, never.